Hi there, everyone. My name is Michael Smiley. I'm the Director of Finance, Estates and Digital for the North Cumbria Integrated Care NHS Foundation Trust. And I'm going to talk to you today about our annual report and accounts. I'm specifically going to focus on our accounts for the year 2020-21. Now, during the year, the Trust operated within the temporary national financial regime, which was instituted as a response to the pandemic. We achieved our planned financial performance in that regime overall. We had a deficit of 7.4 million against a planned deficit of 8.9 million. So we're actually slightly better than our plan. And that's amazing when you think about what we were doing in the pandemic at the time. Now, however, on an underlying basis, our trust does have an underlying deficit uh, and it is unsustainable if we remain in that position. So we're focused on our long term financial recovery as we look ahead. The future financial regime will probably require the trust to reduce its annual financial running deficit substantially. So during the year post merger, we embedded our financial controls and our budgetary controls to ensure we're well prepared for that future where we're going to have to increase our financial recovery. By achieving our financial plan during the year, during the pandemic, we've demonstrated an overall stronger financial performance than in previous years where we didn't meet our financial plans. Now, during the year, we actually spent £317 million on our staff, which was our biggest area of expenditure. Around about 75% of the trust expenditure is on staff. We also spent £40 million on clinical supplies, and that includes an extra £8 million on PPE for the year, which the Trust was funded for from the National Pandemic Funds. We spent £38 million on medicines. So that just gives you a flavour of where the money goes and how it's spent. We invested heavily during the year with monies we were able to secure from government. So we spent about £48 million on new investment in new assets. Now, these include... £33 million on buildings, a variety of different building projects, including our cancer centre, which we were able to open in the spring. And that was our largest initiative in the year. We also invested at West Cumberland Hospital, continuing the development of that site in anticipation of further large builds in the future. We spent £11 million on plant and medical equipment. Specifically, we refreshed all of our scanners at the CIC site. So our two MRI scanners and two CT scanners are brand new. And we also spent £4 million on digital technology development because in future we want our NHS to run less on paper and more with digital technologies. So that's a massive amount of investment in our assets for the future. Now, many of those investments were made alongside donations from our legal friends, for which we're really grateful. And I recall meeting a number of our legal friends accepting donations from them and passing on my thanks in person. But I'd like to do it on the record now as well. So thank you very much. Now, our report on accounts is on the website. Um, please do have a look. And I look forward to seeing you on the 2nd of November alongside all of my director colleagues, where we'll be pleased to answer questions. Thank you.